Hey guys, Skelly back. And before I say anything, I want to tell you that I'm making a new series. And this is going to be called Pixel Foe. And it is a series about me telling you new things about gaming. And this is my first video on it. And I hope you guys enjoy this. And I also want to say thank you for all the support. I've gotten 59 subscribers right now. And I'm probably going to get another one after this video. So see you guys and I'm gonna start the video okay guys the first thing I want to talk about is Lucario is in and if you've been looking at all my comments and stuff which you probably haven't been because it's hard to see them on my channel you know I love Lucario and I, I'm just scrolling through these photos I found on um Super Smash Bros and this looks really cool you know it, the graphics and everything looks good and the reason why I chose this picture also was because he got that um, ability where someone punches him, he comes back very fast and very speedy. I like this move because it is very nice and awesome, and sometimes it could help you and everything. And I haven't mastered it yet, but I think it would have been really cool. Okay, guys, with the second picture of the day, this is Little Mac. And I never played any of the games, his games, but this looks amazing. Literally, it is looks so cool, and also the map behind it. I chose this picture because the map behind it just looks amazing. I, I just want to play on that. It has good graphics. He looks really cool. And this, I think this is mega form. I'm not positively sure, but it looks beast. It looks like he's like the Bowser kind of thing from Brawl. He looks like he just obliterates everything in its path. That's why I like this picture. It's really cool. Speaking of new characters, there's Rosalina and Luma. I really enjoy this character. She looks really good, and I always like liked Rosalina for the Mario Kart games and all of that stuff. She looked really boss, and uh, I just wanted to say that because I don't know any of her moves yet or anything, so this is all she has for now. Okay, guys, let's get on to the starter Pokemon. Um, right now. Uh, Greninja and Charizard has have been uh, released as whole new Pokemon. Greninja is completely new, and Charizard is now a, not attached to Pokemon Trainer. I like this, and a lot of it. Like, I like this a lot. I, even though, and here I just want to tell you guys, I think Greninja and Lucario are basically like the same Pokemon, but Lucario is basically the stronger, but slower type. And Greninja's the faster, but less strong. It, it's it's kind of what I think because if you look at the music on the direct and all of that stuff, uh, it doesn't. I don't see that much of a difference. Uh, you, you could even see that giant water ball looks like the Aura Ball. It's you know it's like that. You don't you don't have to believe me. Okay, guys. Speaking about things getting split into part, Samus and Zero Suit Samus have been split apart to two whole different characters. Uh, I This is really cool. I, I have to admit that um, this is a great idea and I think because uh, they're like two different things and uh, on Brawl it, it was hard because like it, you didn't really want to uh, use your ability and turn into Serious Suit Samus but sometimes people will like Serious Suit Samus and they enjoy being her. Okay guys, sorry for um the bad quality for this right now. I have to zoom it in. But uh this is Sheik and uh Zelda and they are not one character also like Samus and Zero Suit Samus. Uh she well I think they're both she, but I'm just gonna call yeah they're both a she duh. But um they're both Zelda. Well this is confusing but I actually enjoy this kind of I, I like that both being together but this is this is good. Um, yeah, it kind of confuses me a lot. But they look really good to fight as a team. Like they look like a team. Uh, and this is also going to be the last of the characters. I'm going to start talking about um, the consoles of X. Uh, the consoles, like you can sure you get the 3DS one or the Wii U version. But I'm going to get onto that in a sec. Ladies and gentlemen. Girls and boys, this is what we have been waiting for. The consoles! From both sides, we've got 
3DS in one corner and Wii U in the other. Who would win in a competition of which one to buy? Super Smash Bros. Well, everyone knows that. Well, if you look into the direct, you will see that the 3DS is coming out first. And I believe that is so because they have been working on it first. They have been, like, finding ideas and editing on it first, and then they're going to upload the Wii U. Wii U is probably going to be near uh, December time for the holidays of Christmas and all that stuff. So, you could possibly... That would be good for some sales if you want it. I bet you it would get a lot. But I w think they would have gotten more money if they put the Wii U first and then the 3DS. Because everybody wants Super Smash Bros. People would buy the Wii U for Super Smash Bros. That's so much popular. Well, much popular isn't sentence, but that's how popular Super Smash Bros. is. Now, as I always wanted, I wanted the Wii U version, because I've been used to Brawl and using the controllers, which is easier than using, uh, pat, like, you know, those, um, buttons and all that stuff on the, uh, 3DS and the DS and all that, stuff like that. There, I hope that they, you could use Wii controllers for it. I, I bet you it would be. If they don't, I'll be kind of sad. But I, I, that's why I'm using it, because I'm used to Wii controllers. And plus the bigger screen, res well, bigger screen. And I have been waiting for this for a while now. And so now, since we know the direct dates, I am pretty happy. And now, guys, here's some things. Most people have a 3DS more than a Wii U. That I, th that is, what it is. Everyone has to admit that. But by putting it for the Wii U would be uh, would get good, and a lot of people would wait for it. But you might want to have the game for first. So I recommend buying the 3DS one first, and then. Um, buying the Wii U version for Christmas or just wait for the Wii U version or just get the 3DS version but I'm recommending the Wii U right now because it just I just want it for the controllers uh... It looks pretty boss and guys if you're wondering how I got my Wii U I did not buy it I won at a tournament um, of playing Super Smash Bros. Melee, the first time I played Super Smash Bros. Melee, I had I won it, and that was really cool, and it was really exciting. I've actually gotten second place, but the person who got in first place won the other tournament on Mario Kart, which I got in fourth place on, sadly. But, um, so I've gotten a Wii U, which is nice. I don't use it that much, but I have it. And I only play like WarioWare on it, but that's what I got it, and it's pretty cool. And I recommend you guys buying it if you don't have it right now. It's it's one of the, um, the consoles I like. And guys, sorry to uh, make the video stop here, but I'm gonna have to end it here now. And hope you guys liked it. And uh, please leave some feedback. Feedback. I can't talk today. And tell me if you want me to do some more of these. Uh, it's really exciting for me to make a new series, especially when it's not Minecraft. So, see you guys later, and um, hope you liked it. Bye, guys. Thanks for joining the Skeleton Crew.